We are less than one month out from tax day and millions of refunds have already gone out. The IRS said it's issued more than 45 million refunds to filers worth collectively over $152 billion. The IRS is estimating that the average payment this year is worth more than it was last year, although officials say that could change by the deadline on April 18th. The IRS said it's working tirelessly amidst what it's calling a challenging tax season because they're still working to finish off a massive backlog of unprocessed tax returns from last year on top of the ones coming in for this year. All right, well, with tax filing season well underway, whether you're talking about Social Security investments, Medicare premiums, or other tax-related issues, it's important to understand the difference between tax opportunities and tax traps. And this is especially important for older Americans. So here to break down the difference for us is author of Senior Issues Advocate and President of uh, the company Retirement Genius, Chris Arrestis, joins us this morning. Chris, good morning. How are you today? Good morning to you. Yeah, glad to have you here. Okay, first time I've heard about this difference between tax opportunities and tax traps. What exactly do you mean by that? Well, when people become seniors, they, they retire, they cross over the ages of 62, 65, they're qualifying for things like Social Security, Medicare, then the way that tax treatments happen for them starts to change. So there's different things that people need to look at when they were working, they were taxed one way, but now that they're retired, they're older, they're on entitlements, taxes change, and they need to be aware of where the opportunities are. But if they get it wrong, where the traps can be. Mm. Chris, talk a little bit about why it's so important that our seniors know about this information and any changes. Well, seniors are living on a fixed income, so you've got to understand what your real dollars are you're working with. You know, there's your gross money, but then there's the net money after you've paid taxes. And it's the responsibility of every American to pay their fair share, but it's also the responsibility to not pay more than you need to. So understanding things like what the tax implications could be on your Social Security benefit, for example, how that could be a tax trap if you don't do that right is important. What about retirement accounts, opportunity or trap? Well, when once you've retired, your income comes down and that can reduce what your capital gains are. So if you get it right, it's a tax opportunity. You could be dropping from 20 percent to 15 percent to even zero percent capital gains based on your income. So timing things like investments and, and, and selling assets is important relative to your income, your age and your taxes. Now, what about long term care expenses? Those can really add up. Is there a tax opportunity there? There is. You can, if you're, if you are paying for the cost of nursing homes, assisted living, uh, whatnot, you can deduct those expenses. Also, if you have a qualified long-term care insurance plan, you can deduct those premiums. And if you're a family caregiver and you're spending money out of pocket, mm. there's tax deductions there for helping a loved one. Uh, one last quick question. You had mentioned Social Security just a bit before. Can you tell us when it's taxed and when it isn't again? Yes, absolutely. If you are making more than $19,560 this year in 2022, then there can be a tax impact against your Social Security. And I always encourage people, try and earn an income still when you're retired, when you're on Social Security, but just be aware that as you're earning income, if you cross that line in 2022 of $19,560, there could be tax implications against your Social Security benefit. You could actually pay uh, taxes out of the benefit. We don't want to see that if you don't have no. to. Yeah, so make a little bit of money, but not too much there, right? Yeah, that's right, right. And, and don't be discouraged from earning money, but, but just be aware that there are tax implications. Mm -hmm. Okay. Well, Chris, thank you. Hopefully you've made uh, taxing uh, and tax season just a little bit easier for some of the seniors here yeah. in Connecticut. We do appreciate yeah. it. Mm -hmm. Tax season's coming up, so everybody get ready. Oh, yeah. Chris, yeah, thank you. Thanks so much. Thank you.